Hey everyone, Flying Dutchy here, welcome back to the United Netherlands. I boosted the graphics a bit, so now the game looks like this when I zoom in. It's a bit uh, more normal, it's still not very pretty. But we need to keep this game running, otherwise we'll never finish this uh, this run. Um, we're losing a little bit of money suddenly, I don't know why. Maybe because I restarted the game and something recalculated. Could also be the investment pool that uh, went down a bit. And look at this guys, we are going to get the Mosque of Jen, which will give us more education access, which is, uh, I think, really good for us. Great Britain is importing Man Wars as well, my goodness. Everyone is taking our Man Wars away before we can even put it in the Navy. Unbelievable. So you know 29, but I think they are going to get more. Um... Because I think they just need to get employed. Yeah, and that takes a bit of time. But we will get those navies up. We will have 40 ships uh, very soon. That's decent, I would say. My plan is to annex my Dominion. The Dutch East Indies. Uh, we are friendly with them. Maybe we should stop this. But before we do this, I will make another save. Just in case things go wrong. Not Netherlands in the war, just Netherlands let play. There we go. And then I'm just gonna try this. Annexing of my vessel and see what happens to their vessels. If they become free or if they become my vessels. I need to see this. Uh, so we cannot do this right now. Because we have too much relations. United Netherlands cannot have a vessel type subject due to being... What? That is a really weird first sentence over there. Oh, we get even more infamy when I do this. Let's just begin damaging relations. For a while and then we will see. Because we also have this uh, 33 infamy for now. Which is a lot. Gold feels depleted. We always click unfortunate then. Are there any more gold mines I can make? Yes. Dutch Guyana. That is over here. So we have uh, four gold mines here very soon, which will give us more pr uh, printing money. Or minting money. Also the right thing to say. Um, should we lower the taxes even more? No, I will do this and remove the... Cons but this is a lot of money, right? Eh. Can I use my authority otherwise? Maybe. If we look at our market. We have too many paintings. We still need more luxury furniture. Let's look at our furniture stuff. Um, boom, boom. Furniture factories. Valonia is not doing the precision tool, so we should actually do this. Yeah, that helps a little bit. Do we need more luxury clothes? No. We keep it how it is. Brown started to make puppet the diplomatic play against Brazil. Really? France is going to puppet Brazil? <laughs> wow. Are they crazy? Yeah, artillery is a bit expensive. Let's build one level. That should normally fix it. Of course, we are using a bit more artillery for our new barracks that we build. That we are gonna build in uh, Indonesia. We now have 16. Was that it? That was it. We have a battalion on the reserve in Indonesia. Oh, you have this uh, penalty, right? I don't know. Let's promote you anyway. You need a lot more troops. Should build a couple more over here. Apparently this is not hurting our... Um, infrastructure. Yeah. 
keep building up slowly. It'll take a while until this friendly modifier is gone. The Dutch East Indies. We're gonna annex it. I still want to take a lot of land in Africa. Thing is, if I take the state, how much infamy is that? Uh, conquer state. 13 infamy. Ugh. 20 conscription battalion, that's good. S sour truth. Given the low wages. Really? Oh, it's a uh, thing for a compulsory primary school. Can make the trade unions unhappy or the industrialists. Let's not make the industrialists less unhappy. So we will go with... And we got the right one. 10% extra uh, enacting chance. So that's really nice. And I really like the fact that we have built everything. We have all the buildings that we can build. Everything. We don't have silk and, m and mice. So we have everything in our own market, except for the silk. I think silk is the only thing that I'm importing a lot of. Let's have a look. Go away then, if that is not profitable. What is this? Oh, we are still importing a lot of wood, right? Yeah, because we don't have enough uh, lumber mills. So we will have to keep doing this, especially from Scandinavia and Russia, but that's fine. Uh, let's put this back to normal. Actually, let's uh, encourage export, because that is the cheapest for us. Uh, imports, right? Yeah, we are, we, are, we are encouraging exports from the other countries. I think that is how you need to read it. The same goes for iron. Dice, we are exporting a lot, I think. Yeah. Need to protect the domestic supply bit, so we make a bit more money. We are exporting our sugar. Also uh, protect that a little bit more. We are importing and exporting hardwood at the same time. <laughs> oh, porcelain. We are importing a lot of porcelain. And we still need this, so let's keep that on. Yeah, and here's our silk. We only need a little bit, 226, but I would like to get that for myself. We are exporting things that I really don't want to export. But we can't stop it. Because we are not having isolationism. Okay, we are going to get some more engines. I think we're going to build everything because later on we still need more and more and more. A little bit more cloves yet. Yeah, cloves are still super expensive, by the way. What technology do I need? Electric sewing machines. That will completely solve the problems, I think. Rubber rush, yes. It's gonna cost us so much electricity again. How do I make my electricity plants more efficient? By coal-fired plant. We need the steam turbine. And then we need a lot of coal as well. I really need the coal-fired plant. Because we are gonna use so much electricity. This will be the next technology I'm gonna pick. If I can get it, of course. Now our GDP is growing like crazy. We are number 5 GDP per capita and 6 worldwide. Our uh, living standard of living is going up. Everyone should be somewhat happy with it. And our population is number 12 in the world for now. Of course a lot of people are also in the colonies. And they are not incorporated. Um... Does this? No, nope. you don't want trade agreements, you need to pay for it. I will keep my surplus of influence so that we can tick our infamy down a little bit quicker. Yeah, I'm playing on speed 5, it's still going slow. 
I don't know why. I think it's going the same speed as, I, as it did in uh, uh, the last episode when I was on lower graphics. But guess what guys, if you guys keep supporting the channel like you do the last days, there will be a new computer. So Then I can finally get an upgrade for my 5 year old build here. I think it's even 6 year old right, right now. Uh, the industrialists have raised their concerns. Yeah. Uh, let's do this one. I don't want to piss off the uh, industrialists. Some more barracks coming in. We are number four in the world. We just beat uh, Russia. So we are doing really, really good. And what the hell is happening over here? France is at war with Russia. Are you going to take Russia down? Oh, yes they are. Uh oh. What are they gonna do? Some more small arms. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I can also go to the repeating... Oh, that is actually not a bad idea. Let's do that one. And then we can go to breach loaders and make more artillery. That should solve the problems. Oh, yes it did. And we make a lot of money suddenly because our military is cheaper. Nice. Really good. Yeah, all our arms industries should do this. Eventually you want everything on the highest setting. Because then they work the most efficient. How is my opium doing? Are people uh, making opium over here? Yes, they are. Now, if I put my barracks to uh, first aid, we need how much opium? 146. That is okay. And this one? 292. But I really want this. But it's so expensive. Can we do first aid for now? Yeah. Let's do that. People coming to Flanders. Tensions I don't care about. Wallonia is still in turmoil. I think that is still because of the, co of the conquering of them. Because they are doing fine. There's nothing I can do in this uh, state. My iron mines are not do doing that great. And that's because iron is cheap. Well, that's actually not bad. Because then my steel mills will be very profitable. Yes. Do want some more universities so I can tech up a little bit faster. My coal mines, on the other hand, are doing fine over here. Let's build a couple of coal mines in Valonia. Maybe that will get rid of their turmoil. Yeah, who knows. Farms are still doing fine. Everything is doing fine in the country. Need to let the, the, the game speed uh, up and uh, get rid of our infamy. Keep colonizing everything. Would like to take Sokoto down. Maybe we can get the port of Oyo and then this. So we have an entrance here and here. Scandinavia is over here. Great Britain. Liberia is... Sectorate of the USA. States. Utayalon is there. Futa Yoro. Segu. We can take those tiny states before France takes them. You could take down Wadai so we can colonize Dar al Kuti. That sounds like a great idea, actually. But Dutchy, then you're gonna get more infamy. Yep. But I still think I'm gonna do it. Ah, oh, the infamy. And we are already done with constructing buildings, so that is how quickly we are making buildings. It's insane, actually, how quickly we are making buildings. So we should get more rubber. There we go. We should get 
more luxury. Furniture, but the furniture is built in a couple of states. Let's go there. Let's keep on pausing the game, because the time goes by slowly anyway. I'm always wanting to uh, pause the video, uh, pause the, the game. Uh, furniture. Okay, all of you are doing the precision tools. That's the only thing we can do to make more luxury furniture. We have too many rich people in our country. <laughs> well, in Flanders we have the most um, people, so let's build those in Flanders. Luxury clothes is the same thing. My textile mills are not doing all of this, but if I do this we have too many luxury clothes. If I do this that is actually okay, but then I don't have enough normal clothes, so... For the textile mills we still need to make a difference. But they are still both way too expensive. Oh yeah, the electric sewing machines. Electrical capacitors. We need those electrical boosts. First we need to make our power plants more, making more electricity and then we're going to boost our mills with electricity. That's what I'm going to do. That would solve that problem. So what am I going to build then? Well, no idea actually. More opium. There we go. The whole country is going to use opium. <laughs> oh my goodness. Yeah, and tools are getting expensive again. With five levels over there. Flanders is uh, getting one of my best uh, states. People are actually going out of here towards Gelre. Very interesting. My commander is now having 36. In Indonesia, that is decent. Expand the rubber industry completed, the rubber boom. Because we just upgraded our rubber plantations, I guess. Let's have a look at our journal. Ships of the air, we can't get zeppelins, I think. Monitor, ironclads. Eiffel Tower. Just researching things. Some decisions. I'm not gonna do this one. I'm not gonna give the Dutch East Indies my stuff, because then they get all the armies. And then they are going to revolt and then I lose everything. So, absolutely not. Not going to happen. Could expel the diplomats for now. But then I get infamy. I don't want infamy. I guess I will just go after Dutch East Indies when I uh, actually can. You are tributary. You as well. Come on. Sometimes when you click you get to that information screen and sometimes not. And you? You have no one. Oh, there is revolutionary Zulu again. It happens all the time. Motion things. Oh yes, that will make the uh, armed forces give me the bonus. Diplomatic tour. Mm. No, it's not make you too strong. And this is... Well, you're gonna piss off the trade unions. They are still loyal enough to give both bonuses and we now have 30% chance to get to school. Good. I think I was going to take a uh, button. Because you have an alliance with Bulungan, and then I can take both. Let's just take those. 
Uh, metal is let's play overrides. I just always save the game before I go to war. Conquer the state of Bhutan. Bhutan and Bulungan. That sounds like a great idea. I think the uh, Bulungan said no, because they are not in the list. Yep. <laughs> they said, oh, I'm not going to help you. <laughs> Okay, that's gonna be my uh, my own war then, I guess. Yeah, uh, let's uh, get my Indonesian general mobilized and send you over there. He should arrive here very soon, because he is already in Indonesia. He's 72 years old. I don't like that. Want to keep this one for a while. Furniture factories are getting built. That is going to, going to solve all of those problems. The tools are already in. No, not yet. I think they're going to back off. Let's do that one. That's okay. Let's give the intelligentsia a bit more uh, influence. My armed forces are just way too strong. All the opium. We're having first aid. It already gives 50% recovery rate, so that is actually not bad. Cost 18,000 right now to do this because we don't have the tools and the opium. What I can do is do this. And fix my opium and... Oh no, that's just way too expensive. I'm not gonna do that. Thing is, if I get more opium, people are going to import it. Improved fertilizer for the chemical plants and fertilizers for the farms. Chemical plants... I'm gonna make so much more fertilizer, which I don't need. But my farms are going to use it now. We can publicly trade you now. And now I can put the fertilizer on my farms. So. The war with Bhutan has broken out. This should be over very soon. Did I get a lot of infamy for this? No. And I like that. That was it. <laughs> Oh yeah, we need to get our electricity. Where is it? This one? No. This we need for our um, mills, our, our um, clothing to get up to a uh, date. But we need better electricity. Oh, where was that one? The steam turbine, right? Yeah, it takes five years, but I think I need it. Hey, we have uh, compulsory primary schools now, and that means that we can put our institution, if I have the bureaucracy, to level 5. So, we need to build more governing uh, buildings. Let's do this. Oh, I can also do that here. Government administration. Let's build four of these bad boys. We have a spare. We have something to spare, I should say. Yeah, now we need more transportation. And I already saw that somewhere that we can use that. Because the... Landers will need like three levels. Elra can use two levels as well. There we go. Now this war will be over soon. We just need to wait for them to say, uh, okay, we lost. 
I really want to take the rest of Indonesia, and I'm just gonna go for it. I will uh, wait and see what Great Shing is gonna do against us. Uh, of course, they have a huge army, but they only have 16 flotillas, and I think their production uh, method of their barracks is not that high. Well, they are on line infantry. I should be able to def to defend against them. And I'm going to give this a chance. They will not say yes for a while. Oh well. Any buildings I want to keep here? Fucking okay, cabs. Yeah, I think we can keep this just a couple of buildings. The election is over. Well, you're not gonna change anything. What I should do is get a new law. Um, I can go to protected speech, which will give us more technology spread. The armed force, we lose the bonus with the armed forces. I don't want to lose that for now. Um, so we have the schooling system. We have public schools, public health. We should get some... Uh, Maybe old age pens, pensions, so we can pay for people if they are getting old. So we'll radicalize the industrialist. Oh. Yikes. I don't want to change anything of this, right? Well, well, I can go maybe to the elected again, but that's not doing a lot for us. I want to keep professional army and national guard. I don't want to go to graduated because we lose money. So there's a lot of thing, things I don't want to change anymore. We could go protected speech then, but no, the armed forces. We can get workers protection. Oh, that's uh, radicalizing. I don't think I want to do anything then, for now. The industrialists are becoming uh, a problem. They are losing their money, so I understand why, but... <laughs> Anarchy law. Hey, we now have... Okay, Bouton is part of the Dutch Celebes. So no. Really? You have another state over here? Oh my goodness. Bouton is now over here. If I knew that, I would take that as well in the peace deal. Infamy is now down. Maybe we should give it a try to take the rest of Indonesia. I like it that uh, the Papua colonies are growing very fast. Colonizing everywhere I can, where I have a influence point. I think I want to take Wadai now, so we can colonize a bit more in uh, in Africa. Save the game. It's just waiting for us for technologies, really. Oh! And why is Prussia not on our side? Did they break the alliance? No. And they should join, right? Because we have an alliance. Uh, Prussia? What is happening, game? Uh oh. <laughs> oh no. What is going to happen? Why is Prussia not on our side?
I wonder if they're going to call in France. That would be a problem, I think. Now, on the other hand, we have some very good... Yeah, France is on our side. Uh, on the other side. Uh, what do you want? Humiliation offer on France? Yeah, sure, join me. Why is Prussia... Oh, they were already in a play, I guess. No. Yes. That is why they can't join. I should have checked if Russia was uh, in a war. Um, so France is now against us. But the good news is we have some really good defensive bonuses. So I'm going to put these... You as well, or...? No, you're going to not go there. Oh yeah, we now have all these colonies over here. We have a front. Oops. You are good at defense. So if I put my two defensive units over here, should be good, I think. Can't beat their boats. It's not gonna work. Well, we don't have pressure on our side. Let's see how this goes. Maybe we are gonna lose everything. It's really possible. Let's wait until they are at the front, then I'm gonna remove gonna move some of them somewhere else. This could go very wrong. Make I can conquer more states. I can take uh, French state, but that is super expensive. I'm going for what I. I'm gonna end that uh, war. I'll just take this country down. Hmm. Electric electrical capacitors, so we can now get the sewing machines and the looms for the textile mills. We can do brine electrolysis for chemical plants. But we need to use so much electricity for this that I need to wait for my tech so I can make more electricity. This could go wrong very quickly. And what is Ashanti trying to do here? Can I... I should take Ashanti down first. Um... Go here. And you are over here. Antonius Schouten is going here, I think. Yeah. And Gottfried is going here. Takes 20 days. Yikes. I should also activate all my conscripts, because this war will take a while. Okay, we are going to the countdown. Why take so long for to go here from here to here? I think when you change your thing, they're going teleport here and then they go to the new front, which is so stupid. Torpedo boats for our naval bases. We get more offensive for ammunition. Okay, but we don't have that right now, so let's not do it. I don't understand why it takes so long to get there. They are yet just in time. So I should be able to take this French Sahara thing, or Morocco thing. I should be able to take this down. And I should be able to defend this because I have my defensive expert over here. If he can't hold this line, I can't do anything against France. Let's have a look. Actually, Great Britain is going on the offensive. Well, I'm not. Um... We should win this. 
We have 120 offense and we are not winning. Yeah, sure game. Of course. And my troops over here did not arrive in time for some reason. And now they are going to take everything. Poof, poof, poof. Until I'm here. It should be very soon, hopefully. Otherwise, we're going to lose everything. Yeah, finally. Now, we should be able to win the war goal at least. This is just ridiculous. And how is it going over here? Yeah, you are losing and then we will get a... Uh, they're going to attack me. And then I should be able to defend it because of our good defensive bonuses. Otherwise, I don't know what to do. Oh, I was paused, really? Mm -hmm. Gotta kill all of that, of course. This takes a really long time. For some reason, my... Uh, my war support is going down more than they do. Which is completely stupid. And something you don't control. It is unbelievable, really. It really is. No, are they attacking me now or... Yeah, they will attack me. And we should have a huge defensive bonus. Yeah, they can't win this. We have 118 defense, so we should be able to hold off France there. Oh, I took all of this. Yes, I took the French colonies over there. Where are you going? Senegal front. there. It takes 18 days to go from here to here. Well, I guess that makes a bit more sense, but it's stupid. Mm. Losing a lot of money. Wadai should be mine, and then we should uh, piece them out of the war, and then we free up our uh, armies to do something else. Yeah, we are holding off the French here. Very nice. And Great Britain is trying to push. What is this with... Uh, I think I need to put the clouds off. I think the clouds are just doing horrible things to me. How can I put the clouds off? No idea. Yeah, the game is just running too slow for me. It is, it's going in two frames per second. I think it also is because of this... The game is not optimized, if you ask me, because I have I don't have these problems with other games, so. Now, it's going to take a while. I have to restart the game and I go back to the lowest graphics, because otherwise the game is just not going. Which is a shame. They're losing this. Yeah, they have also 100 defense. Yeah, Jan needs to go away here. Only only Schouten should should be here. Because uh, Schouten is having the, uh, the fight bonuses. Okay, the Ashanti is now mine? No. 
Wait, what? Why not? Why did I not get Ashanti? That was my Wargle, right? I don't know. Weird game. Very weird game. It really is. The nice thing is I can just quickly take all of this. Because they don't have an army there. Still holding France? Yep. France's war support is actually still very high. We can't peace out. It's going to take a while. We're using up our money. That's okay, I guess. Oh, I can put my uh, institution to level 5, my education. Just a couple of fronts left. You have nothing under construction, that's fine for now. No Lanang, because you are a tributary of... Okay, we took all the states and then we can colonize here, right? No, because we have no interest. We have to wait for that interest to uh, come alive and then we will colonize the middle of Africa. Central. The uprising, that is exactly what I want. With the two odds, so we will take those. That state will be mine as well. Automatically. I am winning and losing against France. This one needs to go away here. We can only do this when the battle is over. My economy can also be very down because I am not building, of course. Because sometimes building makes your economy go better. That is possible. No one's gonna help here, right? No, so two water will be mine, this uh, state here. They have only four conscription centers, and that's it. Okay, we're gonna humiliate France, I think. I think we can get, uh, reach this. And NATO Uprising in Papua! Good. More states for free. Russia abandoned the Netherlands. We don't have the alliance anymore. And they did do that because we have this uprising. War of Tuat is broken out. Jan van der A. When you are done with that what, battle, you need to go to Papua. You can click this when this is available. He's now in a battle. You can see how expensive our army is and you see how much mo money we are losing. Now hurry up. Ah, oh, the game runs so slow.
This battle takes forever, isn't it? So they are gonna take my land now. Are you kidding me? Yeah, they are not available. No, he is. Go here. But I guess that's going to be too late. I want to be at peace. I could also do a white piece. Now, let's do the humiliation anyway. French one again. We are losing a quarter million a week. A quarter million. My army did not arrive yet. They are going to take my colonies. Because it takes 35 days. No. I need to be at peace before I go bankrupt. Let's make, uh, let's tax the people a bit more. Let's do some uh, rust exchanges for a while. Papo is going to take everything. Because my army was not uh, prepared. Oh, no, they are not attacking me. So apparently we will be okay. Lucky as I guess. So France, do you want to uh, say yes to this peace deal? I don't have to piece them out because... I'm at war here, so I can't uh, put my uh, my troops down any again anymore. Only when you are not at war anymore, so nothing I can do. Now we are finally taking down uh, Papo over here. Yep, boom. It's all going to be mine. Fairly easily. I have to put a uh, cut in the video. It's a 48 minute episode. Oh, and uh, France took a bit of uh, Wallonia. So that is not good for us. We need to peace out France sooner, I guess. Anyway, thanks for watching and I see you in the next video. Bye bye.